So Donald Trump had a rally in my home state of Minnesota last night, a little town called St. Cloud. A nice enough town just outside the Twin Cities it does have a pocket of Republican trump It also has a large Somali population too, so I'm not sure how this all works. Anyway, Donald Trump gives his little rally and gives his speech. And Donald Trump has put himself in a bad situation. He's in a no-win situation. He's painted himself into a corner. Because at this speech, he was saying how he has nothing to do with Project 2025. That's the radical right bullshit. I have nothing to do with that. In spite of the fact that the staff of the Heritage Foundation, the people who produced this document, are largely staffed by former Donald Trump staff members. And in the document itself, it says Donald Trump's name 300 plus times. Donald Trump knows this is bad for him, so he's trying to disavow it, but he can't because his hands and his name are all over it. He keeps pushing that fact. Now here's where the real problem comes in. He's never going to be able to convince the moderates or the left, certainly, that he doesn't isn't involved in this thing, but now he's pissing off the radical right. They don't understand what's going on here. Donald Trump's trying to straddle the fence, but he can't. Now the radical right, which is his base, is getting pissed off because he's shitting on them. Project 2025. He's trying to back away from abortion, but he said that I'm responsible for overturning Roe v. Wade. You see where he's at here? He's trying to step away from abortion in Project 2025 in hopes that moderates might say, oh, he's a good guy. But now he's pissing off the radical right, which is his base. Donald Trump is sinking himself. He's caught between a rock and a hard place. He's painted into a corner. And when Donald Trump is in a situation where you have to make some good decisions, you know Donald Trump is going to fuck it up.